Hello everybody. As you all are aware that there are some very important changes that are happening in the points table from 16th November 2019. So these changes will happen across all skilled migration visas which is subclass 189, 190 and the new visa subclass 491. We did make a video explaining you about all these changes happening on 16th of November 2019 in the points table. We will put the link in the description. In this video, I just want to give you a checklist of things that you can do before these changes commence on 16th November 2019. The first thing that you may want to check is if you've got a partner and if he or she can get a skill assessment in occupation which is on the demand list. If your partner can get a skill assessment, then you will be able to claim 10 points in your EOI. The second thing you want to check is that if your partner can get six each in an English test or equivalent, that way your partner will be able to give you five points and you can claim those points in your EOI on 16th November 2019. And the third thing that you may want to check is if you've done a master's by research or a PhD degree in Australia, you may want to check if you can claim 10 points for a STEM qualification. We recently did make a video about how to claim 10 points for STEM qualification. We will put the link in the description. And the fourth and the last thing is that if you've got 50 points of your own, you will become eligible to lodge your EOI on 16th November 2019 for the Provisional Regional Visa Subclass 491. This is because the state will be giving you 15 points and that will make you eligible to lodge an EOI with a total of 65 points. So you may want to start preparing your documents before 16th of November 2019 so that you can lodge an EOI on that day with 50 points of your own. So I hope this information was useful. If you have any questions about any step of your skilled migration, please get in touch with us. Thank you for watching Cyrus Migration. We make new videos every week relating to Australian migration. If you are interested in this topic, you may want to subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking on the subscribe button down below. You may also want to click on the bell icon to get notified whenever we upload new videos.